Here they are, anthropometric dummies. Here they are, anthropometric dummies. Here they are, anthropometric dummies. Laboratory experiments with animals provide a simple approach to the question. This pigeon, for example, is being reinforced 60 times every hour, but the reinforcements come at irregular intervals. They're more practical than real people for this job because we can insert instruments in their heads, chests, hips, and thighs to learn exactly what stresses, strains, and forces they will face in the secondary collision. In early childhood, it was hard to learn to coordinate seeing and touching. What does it mean? What? Why? Where? What does it mean? What? Why? Where? What does it mean? What? Why? Where? As soon as the child begins to stand up, his legs must support him. The cartilage was only a temporary scaffold, which now must give way to a firm and strong bone matter. As soon as the child begins to stand up, his legs must support him. The cartilage was only a temporary scaffold, which now must give way to a firm and strong bone matter. Laboratory experiments with animals provide a simple approach to the question. Come along, join the family, and gather around all around the Christmas tree. We'll, we'll start with just one row of checkers apiece till you get the idea. So you put them like this, and I'll put mine over here like this. Now the idea is that you move one square at a time, and one checker at a time. And when, when yours get, when yours gets like this, then you, you can jump mine and you take it off the board. They usually approach the figures cautiously. Hesitated, but welcomed the invitation to cling by the figure in green. When they felt secure enough, they might explore the room. When they approached the figure in white, they soon learned it would not allow them to cling. To cling, they had to go to the green figure. We kept accurate records of each chimpanzee's behavior. Before long, they all discovered the white figure represented play. Why does she always have to change your pants instead of picking you up? And you get angry at things as well as people. And as you get older, you have to do even more things you don't want to do, sitting here when you don't even want to go to the bathroom. And they're always taking things away from you. They give you toys that won't stand up. They are always bothering you when you want to be left alone. And then leaving you alone when you'd rather stay with them. These letters are an SD for the behavior of pecking and these for the behavior of turning a circle.
When people train their dogs, the commands, or SDs, are usually verbal. But he does not give up. From the very beginning, he tries to practice. But he does not give up. From the very beginning, he tries to practice. But he does not give up. From the very beginning, he tries to practice. This rat is pressing a lever which causes small electrical stimulations to be delivered to the region of the posterior hypothalamus of his brain. The electrical stimulus is delivered to the brain through long wire leads whenever the rat presses the lever. The experimenter monitors the electrical stimulus on an oscilloscope and lever pressing responses are recorded on a cumulative recorder. So far, this film has stressed conditioning and the control of operant behavior by reinforcing stimuli. Now we shall examine some of the other kinds of stimuli that control behavior. Behavior that has been conditioned in one stimulus situation is likely to occur in other situations. This is the phenomenon called generalization. This pigeon has been trained to pack this black circular disc. Pattern changes and changes again. Because he responds, we can say that he generalizes to patterns of different hues. Because he responds, we can say that he generalizes to patterns of different hues. This is a mask that uh, some people tell me it's mandatory. I don't know if it is or not, but uh, this is a mask they use. This is the original mask, original chair. This is a headrest over here. Well, they, this is adjustable. Any place you want to put it. And the guy by the name of Charles Justice helped uh, design these clamps on this chair. The shock is delivered when the pointer moves up to 300 microamps. Now, the shock interrupts his lever pressing behavior, but he returns to the lever almost immediately and presses again. The second shock also interrupts his behavior, but again he returns to the lever. The third shock temporarily suppresses his operant behavior and produces the visible respondent behavior of panting. In 15 minutes, he did not resume pressing and was returned to his home cage. The baby rhesus macaque, three months old, has been trained to press the lever to avoid a 1.5 milliamp shock. A 1,000 cycle tone precedes the shock by 15 seconds and a lever pressing response while the tone is on avoids the shock for that trial. The monkey avoids the shock as long as she presses the lever within 15 seconds of the onset of the tone. This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were this would be a very difficult world to live in if there were no generalization. This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were this would be a very difficult world to live in if there were no generalization. This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were this would be a very difficult world to live in if there were no generalization. But here's what happens when two cars meet at 20 miles an hour. were thrown out of the car. But the wrist motion is achieved by another type of joint called a gliding joint. Because the wrist bones glide over each other as the wrist moves up and down, in the 40 miles per hour experiment, no seat belts were used.
And this shows what happens when your car is stopped by a collision. It is important to keep it in good shape because the backbone is the axis of the skeleton. For a human subject, the differential response may be verbal, or it may be some simple behavior such as pressing telegraph keys. To this day, when I talk about an execution, I still tend to react emotionally. In this experiment, judgments were made from a distance of 80 feet. All these clamps, sir. Push them down like a, used to be a, like an automobile. We always tried to impress on them to drink fluids, uh, water or pop, which they could have pop for their last meal. But we tried to get them to drink a lot of fluid because this made it easier to be electrocuted and also eliminate the smell. <laughs> this day, when I talk about an execution, I still tend to react emotionally. This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were... This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were no generalization. This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were... This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were no generalization. This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were... This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were no generalization. This would be a very difficult world to live in if there were this would be a very difficult world to live in if there were no generalization. The man, however, has mastered the world. The landscape is now stable when he moves his head, but is still reversed. However, this can be remedied. If a steep slope has to be climbed, he must pay attention to the hands and feet. The way it looks and the way it feels then cease to be contradictory. but letters and words still remain unfamiliar. After two months, however, the end is accomplished. Observe that he now can see things perfectly correctly. But Letters and words still remain unfamiliar. After two months, however, the end is accomplished. Observe that he now can see things perfectly correct. 